Hello everybody. In the last session, we learned building simple REST service using Spring Boot. In this session, we are going to learn what is logback and how to configure logback and how do you generate logs by using logback. So what is logback? Logback is an excellent logging framework for enterprise applications. It's fast, simple, easy to use, and it has a powerful configuration options. Let's see how to configure logback and how to generate logs by using logback. So let's get into the coding. So we have the Spring Boot project earlier, which you have shown. Um, let's go and create a logback.xml here. We're not going to write from the scratch. Instead of what we can do, we can uh, go to my GitHub projects and from there we can um, copy the content and paste it over here. So that's why it will be easy for us. So now let's go to, yeah, it's open. Let's copy this content and paste it over here. So now, uh, so this, this is the log pack. How does it look like? So if you look at here, we have a console appender, we have a file appender. Console appender is to write the logs into the console and file appender is to write the logs into the file. And it will write the file uh, into the location which you provided. Let's say provide like spring tutorial or spring tut one. Right and tutorial on tut one, right? Tut one and based on the timestamp, it will generate the log files. Now save it, right? And root level, let's make it info. Otherwise, a lot of um, logs will be generated, which you don't want to see. Um, and now let's go to the controller and uh, initialize the logger. Private static final logger auto logger factory toolkit logger class. Okay, now use this. Let me print the simple log file here and info a I am inside the get data method. So I okay. Now let's run this application. So before that, let's check uh, if there is any folder in my workspace or in my uh, this one. So I don't have any Spring Tute one anywhere here. We have Spring Tute twelve, Spring Tute one, two, three, but there is nothing, no folder called Spring Tute uh, one as we have defined. So let's run. So now, once it gets started, we'll go to the browser and type localhost 80 hello. Okay, we got the response. Now let's see. Yeah, so this is the folder got generated and we have this log file got generated 522 p.m. and this 522 p.m. So now if we open this log and see whether the logs generated or not, right? So this is where it got printed at 2017-11-03, right, 3rd November 2017, and here's the message, yeah. So now we learned how to generate logs by using logback. So now 
that's all about this uh, tutorial in the next tutorial we'll see um, an end-to-end -end application by using spring and couchbase and that will be more fun just wait for that tutorial thank you